How to set up Squarespace online store. Welcome everybody. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create your e-commerce business on Squarespace by selling product and digital things on your website using a free online store built on Squarespace. We'll start off by going to squarespace.com, as you can see in the top left. And as you can see, everything to sell anything, start your free website trial today, no credit card required. So you can set up your store, see if it converts, make changes, and once you're good, you can go ahead and get yourself the paid plan. We'll start off by going to get started in the top right or in the center left. Click get started. As you can see, we'll now have to answer a couple of questions for Squarespace to know what we are about. So let's do, I don't know, jewelry, because we're a jewelry store. You can now describe your site, selling luxury goods. And then you click next. As you can see here, what are your top goals? Marketing myself or my business, sell online courses, sell products. This is a store after all. And then we can also do market myself or my business. You can also do get donations, publish a blog, build a community, sell services, memberships, and all these other things. But we're building a store with, in which we could sell digital products as well, but let's say we're doing jewelry. Now, where are you in the process? Collecting inspiration, formalizing an idea or personal project, turning a project or hobby into a business, growing an existing business, replace my site one with one from Squarespace, let's do turning a project into a business. There you go. As you can see here, make any template yours with ease, change the colors, create a portfolio page, add e-commerce. This is what we want. So we'll choose type online store. There you go. And now best template matches. So you can now go through them. They all look very, very good. In order to sell though, I think this one looks good. You can preview it. And there you go. You can scroll down. This is a very, very slick and good looking template in order to use as a selling point. Now the important part is, is this compatible with an iPad? As you can see it is. And more important, mobile. If it isn't, I wouldn't take it because most of your traffic will be from mobile phones anyways nowadays. So a highly searchable website that is good looking on a phone is a must nowadays. So we're happy with this. Click start with this design at top right. As you can see, now you would have to create an account, which I will do and be back in a second. Now, as you can see, our website has been set up. As you can see, welcome to your site. Creating a beautiful site is the best way to bring your idea to life. Here are a few things to get you started. We can go ahead and go through these questions. What would you like your site to be called? Let's say how to global jewelry. Okay, continue. Edit pages. Add, edit, and remove text or images, customers, and use edit. Okay. Create pages. And now you can use uh, start, get started. But we what we want, as you can see, this is our store. We now want to go to commerce on the left here. There you go. Close this out. And now we are in the e-commerce store of our online store. So what we want to do, set up your store, add products for sale. There you go. Click that. Now it's physical in our case, but you can do digital downloads, service, gift cards, membership, or scheduling like sell life, scheduled services, coaching appointments, or classes. These are only in the paid plan though. You can also import stuff if you already have an Etsy store. But what we want is physical product. There you go. Add store name. How to global jewelry. Continue. Creating product. Now, get your first product. Start by filling out the product name and adding an image. So let's say, necklace you can then add an image click next now 
could set the price. Let's say the necklace costs 100 euros. Quantity, you can do, let's say we have an inventory of 100 of these. You can also remove this and enter unlimited quantity. So that way you just produce what is being bought. Add more details. You can now add a description, which is important for SEO purposes. Let's say, oh, to global neck list. You want to add a bunch of keywords related to the necklace in the description so that people easily find you on Google once they search for it. You can now add custom blocks or content to your product page, add an image. The price is already set. There you go. You can add different variants. So as you can see here, these are colors. Let's say black, add, uh, I don't know, gold. And then silver, but you can also add different options like the size or the material. Let's say it's titanium. Nah. So gold, gold plated, silver, silver plated. And this way you can add different ways of customizing your product. Now visibility, you can enter this as a featured product, give it related products, and as you can see, marketing, SEO and URL. As you can see here, necklace from our store. This description will automatically be generated by search engines. Click below to provide an alternative description. So by clicking this, you can enter a title. Let's say luxury necklace, and then Enter the description with a bunch of keywords related to this uh, necklace or product. By how to global jewelry and apply. And as you can see, we changed it to luxury necklace, luxury necklace by how to global jewelry, which is the way this will look like on Google. There you go. Now, once you're happy with this, go on over here, click save, which is now saving the product. We added a product, now add a way to get paid. This way you can set up the payment processes using Stripe, PayPal, Square. The store currency currently is in euros, but you can go to the bottom and change it to whatever you want. As you can see here on the left, it's currently in euros, but you can do anything. Australian dollars, US dollars, and all these other things. I won't, and I won't set up any payments because this is just a tutorial, but you would need to do that. Now, no need for you to choose a subscription plan. You can just, or you could. So what you want to do is use one of these plans. The recommended ones are probably the best. And once you're done with that, you can go ahead and publish your store. Now, if you see over here, there is our necklace. We can now go ahead and add, it, add more products or edit the existing one. You can now enter this as public. And now we should be able to see it when we look at our website. Yeah. This is clicking the link to our store. And here is the necklace. We haven't entered a picture. That's why it looks like this. You can now also select a detail page. But there you go. There would be a picture on the left here. As you can see, it says necklace. It's 100 euros, how to global necklace. You can now choose the material, the color, and then the quantity, how many you want to buy, then add to cart. You need to select the material first. Let's say gold plated, select the color, black, and then add to cart. It's adding, it's been added. You go to the cart at the top right. And there you go. Yeah, now you go to the checkout. And as you can see, your Squarespace online store has been set up. I hope this video could help you out. If it did, please do a like. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.